Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today we have a brand new perfume to review and it is the new Machino Toy 2 Bubblegum. I am gonna be taking you through my first impressions, explain how it's different to the original, and tell you all about this very unusual perfume. So if you are new here, then hello and welcome. We are all about perfumes here. So check out my hundreds and hundreds of other videos. I have a video all about the original Machino Toy 2, which I'll leave linked down below. And if you're a regular but you haven't subscribed, then do hit that subscribe button and show your support. I really appreciate it. And as always, I will leave a link to where you can buy this perfume down below in the description box in the UK, Europe, US, and at the moment in the UK, this is exclusive to the perfume shop who kindly sent me this. So Machino or Moschino, however you want to pronounce it, you know, you guys know what I mean, of course is a very quirky Italian brand, a brand that has been around for decades and they have had so many different perfumes over the years. All of them are always kind of quirky, kind of different, unusual. They use a lot of bright colors and I think that they're a very like fun brand and a very like unisex brand. So they originally had a perfume called Machino Toy which was literally an actual like cuddly fluffy toy um, with a perfume inside and then they brought out Machino Toy 2 which is a very fresh like fresh clean citrusy clean smell quite light and that came in a sort of yellowy liquid but transparent teddy bear bottle so this new one coming in this bubblegum pink bright pink it's not hot pink it's bright bubblegum pink bottle I think will immediately grab people's attention when they see this they'll want to try it so what does it smell like you guys so I can definitely confirm that this smells like bubblegum if you um used to have bubblegum when you were a child you might remember the hubba bubba pink bubblegum it really is that fruity pink bubblegum flavor it's not like a chewing gum it's not minty it's the fruity pink um, bubblegum and it does smell just like bubblegum flavor you know when you get bubblegum flavor sweets that's exactly what this smells like so they have definitely recreated that exact same smell of pink bubblegum I'd say that 85-90% of the smell is that bubblegum smell there is a on top of that a hint of something slightly floral I know they have some peach blossom in here a little bit of rose and there's also a hint of something slightly fruity and a fresh fruity I know they've got some citrusy lemon notes in here as well as like candied fruit type notes a blueberry I think I can also smell maybe a hint of peach but the main note is that sweet bubblegum smell so I think if you were to wear this people would literally say to you you smell like bubblegum that's what you'd be able to smell on yourself and um, so you obviously have to be a big fan of that smell of bubblegum I know some people are over the years I have seen comments from people saying um, do a video on bubblegum perfumes but I haven't really been able to because there aren't really many perfumes that have a bubblegum strong note that smell like bubblegum so I think people that have been wanting this it's finally here for you the ultimate bubblegum fragrance so I think everyone that loves that smell should should get this um, so I guess it's quite specific um, maybe slightly niche but I know that so many people do love the smell of bubblegum. In terms of lasting power I definitely think this is much stronger than Machino Toy 2 original which was almost like a fresh skin scent it sort of stayed around you but it didn't have strong projection this one is definitely stronger because it has these sweet notes in it in terms of lasting it's an eau de toilette so it's not super long for lasting maybe like three or four hours um but the price is pretty good I think the 30 mil is 39 pounds this is the 50 mil I think this is 59 pounds so um, it's not super pricey. I think obviously if you're a collector of bottles you're probably going to want this if you love pink and everything because 
The bottle is very special, very different. Um, definitely one to add to the collection if you're a collector. So overall, I do think this is a good perfume. I think it will sell well. I think it will stand out amongst all the other perfumes. People will want to try it. And, you know, it would be perfect for a young girl who wants that innocent bubblegum smell, just like for an adult who loves the smell of bubblegums. Um, and I think, I'm sure, you could wear it as a man as well if you love bubblegum, right? Machino Toy 2 bubblegum is definitely Soki approved. What do you think of that, Mr. Teddy Bear? Is that okay? <laughs> Cool. Okay, so guys, let me know. Have you tried this yet? What do you think of it? How do you think it compares to the original Toy 2? Let me know in the comments down below. But that's it, guys. So thanks so much for watching, as always, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.